Hello. So I'm going to show you what free web AR can look like and how easy it is to create. So here's what we're going to create. So we're going to have, we have a simple card here with a hot rod, a background video and icons that are follow cam. Okay. And we're going to show you how you can make those touchable. So let's just go to our system. So here's the scene. Okay. I'm going to simply delete this scene and start from scratch. So to get started, you will go to studio.worldcast.io on your desktop browser. And once you're there, you're simply going to go to the start creating icon as soon as it appears. So we're going to go start creating. We're going to pick Printcast since it's a marker based augment that we're creating. And we're going to select Freemium. In this case, I'm going to call this Hot Rod. I'm going to go next. I'm going to go select file. And I'll browse to my computer where the image already is. In this case, I already have the folder uh, ready to go and all my assets are ready to go as well. This is all depending upon your assets being ready to go. Okay. So it's going to analyze the image and tell us if it's a good marker or not. So that's what, that's another benefit of our system. It'll let you know before you get too far down the rabbit hole, if your image is going to be great for tracking. In this case, we have a hundred percent across the board. So I'm going to go create. So I'm just going to go through this really fast and this, you know, uh, show you how fast you can actually make something. So I'm going to go uh, video. I'm going to again, browse to that folder that I have the assets and I'm going to grab this MP4 right now. Our system only supports the MP4s and I'm going to go, I can hit the play button, make sure it's the right video. It is. I'm going to go upload video. As soon as it comes in, I can scale it up to the size I want it to be. So I'm just going to make it a little bit wider than the actual, uh, print itself. I'm going to rotate up, push it back. You can rotate this canvas around using the uh, guides at the top, rotate camera, pan camera, zoom with the mouse buttons. I'm going to raise up this image or this video rather. I'm going to simply push it to the back. I'm going to go to Sketchfab. You can create a free Sketchfab account. In this case, I'm going to uh, grab Hot Rod and just grab the one I had before. Uh, actually, that's the one right there. I'm just going to import it in. And once it's in the scene, you can just rotate it around to match. Well, I'm going to rotate it around to match up what I already had. So it's going to be a little bit bigger, raise it up off. So it's flush with the, uh, with the print. Perfect. You know what? I'm going to make it a little bit smaller. Perfect. And now I'm going to go to my images. So using freemium, you're allowed to have free images, free links. The difference between freemium and premium is you, you can have unlimited buttons and you can have unlimited, uh, uh, 360 images, uh, you can have more than one audio and you can have more than one video and your, and your limit for freemium is a thousand views per month. Uh, freemium is unlimited views per month for 10 us dollars. So in this case, I'm going to go image buttons. Now you can upload your own assets, which I'm, I'm about to do, or you can go to our library where we have a bunch of them already pre-made for you that you may want to use. In this case, I'm going to go custom image, select file, and I'm simply going to go, uh, grab my images here. So I'm going to go Facebook. Well, let's quickly upload it. It comes in underneath the car, but you can see that it's selected. So I'm just going to raise it up and put it on a little bit of a 45 and move it over to the side for now. Now in here, you can tell it what you want to do. If you want to have an animations or, or anything else, in this case, I'm going to go follow camera. So it'll do that effect that you saw where as the prints rotated, the buttons will always face the user. And we're not going to get any more uh, complicated than that. Maybe I'll just, you know what, maybe I'll have them fade in. So I'll go like a fade in delay and fade in duration of four. And we're going to have to go to URL and I'll just have to go to our website for now. And I'm going to grab the other buttons. Now, I'm not going to link them all just for the sake of time for the demo, but you can easily do what I just did with the, uh, the URL. So I'm just going to move this one over here. We'll go follow camera and I'll do the same thing. I think I put uh, two fours back and check. Yeah, two four. Perfect. They're lined up with the, each other and we'll grab the last icon. 
since we're allowed to have three of them on premium. We're gonna select file. And we're gonna grab the last icon, Instagram, upload, and simply bring it up. Drop it to a 45 angle as well. This case he's a little bit better. Uh, you can resize the buttons. I just left them the size of uh, what they came in at. Since they worked out perfect for my uh, for my first run. So I'm just gonna grab this one and do the same thing and go two and four and follow camera. And that's it, we're done. Let's go save. Save and publish. So once it's saved, it, the QR code will come up. Now there's different ways you can get into it, but in this case, I'm just going to go to my phone and I'm going to scan the QR code in this, in this scenario. So I'm just going to aim at the QR code and we'll open it up. It will come up and tell us to line up our phone with the image. And there we have the buttons fading in. Plus I didn't grab, quick grab the uh, uh, YouTube video. So let's quickly do that and show you how fast this is. Let's go return to the studio. Let's grab this and let's go two, four. Save that. And that's how quick it is to make changes as well. Uh, so all this stuff can be quickly changed. And that's how fast you can create free web AR ready to go. So let's just refresh my phone. And they should all fade in now. Follow the camera. And you get a banner across the top with the freemium that lets you know that it was created with our system Worldcast. So that's one of the, uh, that's one of the, uh, um, elements of the freemium version. So if I tap this Facebook button, it will take us through to the website, which I told it to go to. So that could be your URL, it could be a phone number, but that's how fast it is to create web AR. You can go to uh, studio.worldcast.io, go to worldcast.io to and, and click start for free. It has to be on a, uh, on a desktop uh, browser to create, but it can be on a mobile to consume. And you can also do it this way. If you go to portal.worldcast.io, you can use the scan image instead of the QR code. So you can go scan image and just aim at the image for the natural feature tracking uh, recognition of the element as well. And it's on there nice and stable. Okay, so that's how fast, once again, it is to create free web AR. Go to studio.worldcast.io and create.